And today I'm going to show you how to install Twerp as the custom recovery onto the HTC 10. Now if you haven't done this already, you will need to have the bootloader unlocked on the HTC 10. If you're unclear of how to do this, you'll need to look down into the description below the email or below this video and check out the full tutorial that I have linked as that will link to everything that you need to know including all of the downloads that are required such as HTC, HTC Sync Manager for the drivers, minimal ADB so that you can actually send twerp to the HTC 10 and even the actual twerp download so be sure to check the full tutorial below this video so to start you're going to need to enable developer mode so we're gonna go into the about section and then software more and then we're going to tap on the build number option about seven to ten times until it says that we are a developer then we're gonna go go back and we see we have developer options now right here so just go into developer options and we need to enable USB debugging Once you have enabled USB debugging mode on the HTC 10, you're going to need to launch the minimal ADB and fastboot shortcut, or you can just open up the command prompt and then navigate to wherever you have ADB and fastboot tools. Then we're going to type the command ADB space devices and press enter on the keyboard so that we can launch the ADB service. And we can see that worked correctly as it says Damon started successfully. With the ADB service started, we're going to go ahead and connect the HTC 10 to the computer with a USB cable. We're going to get a couple dialog boxes prompt up here. So we're going to tap always allow from this computer for USB debugging mode and we're going to go ahead and tap on yes for the USB file transfer dialog box. Now from here we can go ahead and boot the HTC 10 into download mode. Again if you're unclear of how to do this be sure to check the full tutorial down below but I'm going to show you right here. So we're going to power off the HTC 10 completely and then we're going to press and hold both the power and the volume down buttons at the same time. And then while you're holding those two buttons down there in the boot, the first HTC logo boot animation, you're going to see it boot into download mode. So while the HTC 10 is still connected to the computer and it is in download mode, we can go ahead and download the twerp image file for the HTC 10. I suggest you go ahead and rename that to twerp.image just so it's easier to type in the command in the command prompt that we're going to do in a second. And once you download it, you'll need to copy or move it into the same folder that you have ADB and Fastboot installed to. So for me, that is C, Program Files 86, Minimal ADB, and Fast Food. Once that has been copied and moved, we're going to go back to the command prompt and type in the command Fast Boot, space, flash, space, recovery, space, twrp, dot, img. Once all that is done, we're going to go ahead and press enter on the keyboard. 
and then we're going to get some some data on the download mode here it says flash images success then we can just go ahead and press the power key to continue when we press the power key to continue it's going to take us back into the download mode main menu so from here we're just going to press the volume down button twice and we're going to boot over into bootloader mode then from here we're going to press the volume down button three times until the boot to recovery mode is highlighted once that option is highlighted press the power button to select it and this is going to boot us into twerp for the first time so from here we're just going to enter our pattern And then it's going to ask us if we want to keep twerp as read only or if we want to allow modifications. Now if we do it as keep only, keep read only, it will not fully install, but you'll be able to do your backup from here. If you ever want to access twerp again, you're going to have to go through that same process of flashing it. So instead, since we actually want to keep twerp on here, we're just going to swipe those white arrows to the right and now we are at the twerp main menu and go ahead and install anything do your backups for now I'm just going to tap on reboot and then I'm going to tap on system so that we can boot back up into the Android operating system and we're back into Android.